What is going on, everyone? We are back with another DRV. This was actually inspired by a customer that said, hey, man, I really want one of those DRVs. Can you make me one with gold knobs in white with a yellow indicator? And I went, yeah, absolutely. That sounds freaking cool. So that one has already sold. This one is going to be up for sale. But here it is. And if you're familiar with the 1981 Inventions DRV pedal, it is a dressed up rat. It really is. Let's call it what it is, because everybody beats around the bush and, well, it's got differences and blah, blah, blah. It's a dressed up rat, and that's okay. It's done really well. Lots of pedals out there are dressed up versions of a different pedal. If you invented the better mousetrap, pun intended, then so be it. You got a dressed up rat, own it. That's what it is. But as you can see, this is not, not a Sue Happy 1981 Inventions DRV. This is a 1983 Morgane. What's the difference? Well, for one, it's a 1983. For another, it's a Morgane. Other than that, I'll let you decide. But it is a phenomenal pedal. It really is. I don't know if it's hype worthy for how much the production pedal goes for, but it is a really good circuit and it sounds awesome. So here is my dry signal. Oh, I got a really wet delay on my bad. Dry signal again. It's a little better. Touch a touch of reverb. So I am using my Yamaha Revstar humbuckers and I am playing through my Bugera Infinium T50. I've got two Celestion Vintage 30s loaded in a closed back cab. And my controls are all sitting right around noon. My gain is just a little past noon. So there's no natural breakup occurring from the amp. So here is the DRV. <laughs> controls at noon. <laughs> Fantastic sounding pedal. One of the things you'll note about this pedal is that the tone control is reversed, so you're actually rolling off tone as you push the tone control up. So. I find it's good right about there. This is has the potential of being a really sharp pedal, and it actually has quite a bit of gain on tap. It has quite a bit of boost on tap, so let's crank it up a little bit. I don't really know what I'm playing, I'm just making it up as I go along, so forgive the sloppy guitar playing. Let's pull that tone back, and let's try it in the neck position will coil taps so now you're really going to get to hear the poor faulty grounding system i have in my house come out listen for the predator hear it it's like a rat into the rat that's got to be some kind of paradoxical thing anyway <laughs> make it drip with some reverb. Not going to be your go-to blues pedal, but it can do it. It can definitely give you a bluesy sound with a little bit more grit. I like it. I think it's got a different application. This is more of like an a straight-up alternative rock pedal. Although, let's kill the reverb. Let's kill the delay. Let's crank the gain all the way up. Take the tone. Roll it off a little bit more. I'll well, leave the volume right where it's at. Shut the coil taps off and go back to the bridge position. Let's see. Will it chug? <laughs>
So obviously I'm out of touch with my metal roots. But yeah, it will chug. It will get the job done. It's not going to be super heavy. If you blended it with an amp that was breaking up, you could probably get some pretty nasty sounds out of it. In fact, since I've already made this a pretty long video anyway, let's go ahead and do it. Let's crank the gain all the way on the amp. Sure. Anyway, that is the 1983 from Morgane, also known as the 1981 Inventions DRV. I'm not going to say it's a dressed up rat, but it's a dressed up rat. Let's just call it what it is, right? We got to be honest with ourselves here. Phenomenal pedal. If you don't have one, you'd like to add one to your board. This one will be for sale. If you don't buy it from me, you will not hurt my feelings. Go ahead and buy the production model or buy another from uh, another high quality builder out there. And this is not a difficult circuit to tackle, so it should be pretty accurate to the original. It's a great thing to have on your board. It's right up there with um, what I recently discovered is a Timmy, and I don't know how I've been playing guitar as long as I have and never used a Timmy. Also a phenomenal circuit, but the 1981, the Inventions DRV rat style thing definitely has its place. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I'm sorry it was kind of a long video. Have a great weekend, everyone.